Set. Despite triple-digit temperatures, the first day of Jackson State fall football practice was full of spirit and surprisingly few to no injuries at all. And I was really surprised to see as many guys ran that thing the way they did, you know, and so I was really glad to see that happen because that goes to show you that most of these guys are in pretty good shape. We got a few guys that got to get caught up, and uh, I think that will happen. And then, like I told them a few minutes ago, that's what training camp is all about, is get in shape. <laughs> During the two-and-a-half-hour practice session, players wore helmets, jerseys, and shorts and worked on offensive and defensive fundamentals. Three new assistant coaches were welcome to practice, including offensive line coach Stephen Acock, linebackers coach Woodrow Lowe, and defensive coordinator Alonzo Lee. Get there, get there, get there, get there, get there. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. It looking, it looking great. Like, like everything Coach Lee tell you, going to be right. Like, he got his own philosophy about behind everything he say. So when he tell you something, they're going to listen because nine, nine times out of ten, you're going to be right. We got to get it done. We got to get it done. So let's focus up. Let's focus up. It's hot. I wish it was hotter. Oh. Uh, first day of practice was great, man. All the guys, man, when we did conditioning test, we had 100% that passed it. So that was a good thing, man. That right there said that everybody was working over the summer. And so... Yeah, everybody working over the summer, man. They, we already know we got going ahead. And really, we, we had fun today. Like, everything was smooth. We just ain't had no, no big time injuries or nothing like that. So, as long as everything moving, we good. What were some of the things you guys worked on today? Run game and the bases of the offense. A lot of bases are what we like to do in the crutch. And um, the things that if you learn these, then the rest of the offense will flow. So we had to learn that, and um, it was a good for JSU will hold its first full pass practice Tuesday as the Tigers prepare for their season opener September 5th on the road against Middle Tennessee State. He's, he's feeling recent. Like he